Uh, good day, my friends. Currently, I'm working on f- 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 custom firmware for SC7H6T units. Uh, I want to tell about uh, current progress. What have I done and added for these new units? Uh, units are started now. Waiting a bit. Okay, unit is started. Uh, the first main thing I was changed is status top area. I totally changed layout for this uh, top icons. I removed some useless icons and added my uh, my own other buttons. Uh, first, I removed to left side recent button. Then I added power button. It has two options. Single click it turn sound to mute. Uh, when you hold and pre- press and hold, it will reboot unit. Rebooting. Okay, it started. Uh, next button I was added is uh, half moon button. It also has uh, two options. Single click it turn screen to black. Uh, when you hold and press and hold it will display uh, wall, uh, leave wallpaper with clocks. Current time and current date. Next button I added is immersive mode button. When you click it, it hides or display again button panel. This button is very useful when you use uh, something like Spotify or Netflix or another apps that has uh, they, that could be covered by another, uh, for example, uh, I see this music. Got it. Uh, for some apps, with, uh, if button panel is uh, on display, it covered some controls. Uh, uh, next thing I open is click for Wi-Fi icon. It open Wi-Fi open settings. Very useful when if you need to open it quickly and change something. Also, I re- uh, reworked uh, this screen, I removed some items, some buttons, and added a notification area, so you can see messages, uh, email info, control your Spotify or Netflix with uh, this notification area, and another things that you wish to do. OEM February doesn't have this option. Also, as you can see, uh, this unit has custom logos for main home logo and bottom climate logo. I moved all logos to the same folder. Uh, go to Eternal. Uh, here is folder logos folder. I moved all, ba- all pictures here, so you have them in the sp- at the same place. Uh, next thing I was changed is uh, changed layout for settings. I fixed some typos. I also removed scrolled when uh, some items not fit. For example, uh, you have seen there that some things was scrolled. Else for here, all settings have uh, correct names and they not scrolling so you can uh, swipe and read them without scrolling. Uh, Edit few custom options. Show volume control when changing. When this option is on, uh, when you change volume, it displays volume control so you can uh, faster 
change it if you need it. Uh, also, I added uh, Android settings. When you click it, it displays full Android settings with single window, so you don't need to browse through uh, settings to access. If you, if you, oh, I think it will be useful if you need fast change some Android settings. Uh, else uh, you can change layout background for settings up. For example, auto will change background with day and night when headlight is on, it displays one background, when headlight is off, it displays another background. But also you can fix and select fixed background, for example, blue, uh, dark one, dark two, dark three, dark four, and you can change to custom background. Uh, I use this picture as custom background for UE team, but uh, you can edit and uh, change as you, as you like it. Next scene was added is launcher PIP app. This is this is PIP window. You can assign any scene you like. Uh, OEM firmware doesn't have this option. You can put here YouTube. YouTube, so you can play anything you like, or you can change to Google Maps, Spotify Music, you can control it. And another things, I think it will be useful when you, if you wish to have home screen with a small widget to display another info. Uh, if you need to reboot unit after change it, I added reboot button here, so you can scroll here and change, then click reboot button. Also added more info about current model, a display canvas type, factory, uh, company, car name, and another display. This window was improved, I removed stars. So you can display more info and looks much better when, than with stars. Uh, also boot screen logo was remade. It displays only icon, only boot logos from logos picture. And I removed all useless pictures from here and added only ones that you can like it. But actually I like to select current card logo from uh, logos folder. Next scene was changed is custom picture for backup camera layer. Uh, as you see, now it uh, displays red uh, Ford Mustang top view logo instead of white sedan that you have with OEM logo. Uh, if you don't like uh, radars or your house car doesn't have radar sensors, you can change settings. 3368 confirm go to vehicle second settings uh, display radar change to off now we need to and now we display uh, big your car logo instead of white sedan or something else this logo can be changed uh, easily just drop new picture to logos folder on internal memory uh, that's all i ah sorry another things was added is 11 new teams for bottom panel i will display you few you, uh, few of them так reboot uh, this is gold UE, black UE. Now we can go to change to another uh, black UE 2. This is another UE team. Uh, 
then Land Cruiser team. I will change car type to switch between this bottom UE teams. This is red team. Another team. This one. Not how it looks. One more. This is the last one, team. Uh, but actually, I like uh, Black UE2 or Land Cruiser team. Uh, that's all my friend. I hope you will like uh, changes I added. Next plot is totally remo uh, rem remake for home screen. I will change to, as, uh, to be uh, equal to bottom panel. Uh, these widgets will be as, uh, ch changeable so you can assign something to bottom area and something to top area. These buttons will be moved to top, and these buttons will be assigned so you can seek assign anything to settings. For example, you can change up shortcut for this button. So you can totally uh, rem remake your home screen and get new options. Have a good day. Uh, I will make new post when edit something cool. Thank you. Goodbye.